before I start this video, I wanted to say that this video is sponsored by Skillshare. Skillshare is an online website where you can learn different type of skills. Skillshare is also tutorial orientated, so it's very super easy to look for what to like find what you're looking for without going through a bunch of unrelated videos. You can also learn different kind of subjects ranging from craft, technology, photography, business, think about movie, illustration, and many more. You can sign up to watch these classes or you can also sign up to teach these classes and make some money on the side. The subscription costs about $10 a month depending on the subscription you're going for. But if you're interested, you can click the link in the description bar and get a three months trial for 99 cents. Thank you so much, Skillshare, for reaching out to me. I truly appreciate it. And since that is said, let's get on with this tutorial. So these are all the stuff you're going to need for this skirt. You're going to need a yard of a denim fabric. This is actually a leftover that I have. So I'm going to try to use it to make this mini skirt. You're also going to need pattern paper. You're going to need machine thread and you're going to need a zipper i would advise you to either use an invisible zipper or a denim zipper which i went out to get the other day but i can't seem to find them nowhere so i'm just going to use a regular zipper but i would advise you to use a denim or blind zipper for this and of course you're going to need your sewing machine so let's get started this tutorial you only need two measurements so your waist measurements and your hip measurements so your weight you're gonna divide your waist measurement by uh, four and mine is steady steady two inches divided by four is gonna give me eight inches so I'm going from here I'm going to mark eight inches and then my and then you're going to distance from your waist to your hips is eight inches you're gonna mark eight inches down is here and then you're going to mark your hip inches there hip measurements there my hip measurement is 42 divided by two divided by four is 10.5 so 10.5 is here and then so here and then you're going to determine the length of the skirt i want my length to be yeah exactly 19 long so exactly the length of this so right now i'm just going to go ahead and connect these uh, these lengths so like this and then straight down like so so you can go ahead and cut it out This, you can see this is a skirt already it's so easy that's how super easy you use you can make a skirt pattern and then when you open it this is your skirt so you're gonna go ahead and cut the front on the fold and the back piece you're gonna cut two because we're going to be adding a zipper at the back you also want to go ahead and add four inches to the back piece because we're going to be adding um, a dart at the back a four inches a dart so, so two darts which are two inches each if that makes sense so make sure to add four inches seam allowance to the back pieces So right now I'm just going to show you how I create the dots. You don't have to like be expert for this. I just fold it in like so. And I'm just going to pinch it a little bit in. Because you just want to give it, you just want to make it have that nice shape at the back. You're just going to pin it. Remember you add that seam allowance for it to go. It should look like this after you're done so you're just going to go ahead and sew it from there to there and repeat the same step for the other side as well this is the front piece i don't know if you can see it this is the front piece right and i'm going to like cut it in the front because i'm going to be adding like a ruffle piece in the front so i need to make a stitch at the front but i want to have like a nice curvy so this is the shape i'm going for so it's like straight 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 
and then we're going to curve down. So this is the shape you want to have. And the last piece you're going to need is the piece that you're going to use to create like the ruffle at the front. And I already went ahead and cut mine. And I also went ahead already and also, you know what, already like make it French at the hem of it as well so what you want to do now is you're going to go ahead and sew the biggest stitch in your sewing machine so from there all the way there and that's the stitch you're going to use to gather this piece i'm going to go to that and i'll come back to show you guys the next step it's already gathered like this and this is the piece we're going to attach to the front so while you're sewing the front piece back together you're going to place that piece in the middle and you're going to sew that so this is it and then you're going to place this right size facing and then you're just going to sew those three layers together okay guys so this is it when you've done pinning it when you open it this is what you should have like so so this is the shape this is what we're going for you see how pretty this is so you're gonna go ahead and sew it from there Till there okay guys so this is it I already went ahead and sew it and also ironed it you can put this like this pin it here because we're going to attach that to the top part of the skirt like so there so right now you can go ahead and sew the back piece you can place the back piece right side facing so and the other back piece like so and you're gonna go sew it from there till there from there till there I'm gonna go to that and I'll come back to show you guys the next step okay guys so this is it already attached on both sides now we're going to work on adding the sleeve uh, sorry the zipper at the back and so now we're gonna determine the zipper length so we're gonna place your zipper like so as you can see and then you're just going to pin close this other part and you're gonna sew from here till the front so while you're sewing the front piece back together you're going to place that piece in the middle and you're going to sew that so this is it and then you're going to place this right size facing and then you're just going to sew those three layers together okay guys so this is it when you've done pinning it when you open it this is what you should have like so so this is the shape this is what we're going for you see how pretty this is so you're gonna go ahead and sew it from there till there okay guys so this is it i already went ahead and sew it and also ironed it you can put this like this pin it here because we're going to attach that to the top part of the skirt like so there so right now you can go ahead and sew the back piece you can place the back piece right side facing so and the other back piece like so and you're gonna go sew it from there till there from there till there I'm gonna go to that and I'll come back to show you guys the next step okay guys so this is it already attached on both sides now we're going to work on adding the sleeve uh, sorry the zipper at the back